What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna go over five reasons on why I believe the navigation and PDR option is totally worth it in today's day. It's 2023, I have a 2017 2LZ Z06 and let's break down my five reasons. So the PDR and navigation what option was standard on three LZs and then a one LZ and a two LZ it was optional. Now my car came with that option, which sure, if your car is low mileage, it might be great for resale value. But um, the number one reason on why I think the navigation is worth it is because of your heads up display. My heads up display is generally always on my speed and the speed limit. Now, the unfortunate part is that there is no cloud update to your navigation, but it is nice to always have the posted speed limit on your heads up display. That way, in case you're out doing some spirited driving, you are you have an up-to-date speed limit or you have a speed limit in general, right? There's a lot of new construction going around and a lot of new developments. So you wanna make sure that you have that there. Now, as far as updating the navigation, um, the 2023 navigation um, upgrade, it's a USB from GM, it's $159. And I do believe it is currently sold out. So maybe hold out for 2024, maybe 2023 will be restocked. But the second option on why the navigation is still worth it today is because um, say your buddy is with you, he's charging his phone, he doesn't want his um, phone to pop up on um, Apple CarPlay. Uh, you can always just plug in the address on your navigation and it's a great backup, right? Um, it keeps his messages or her messages private and uh, you can still find a way to get home. Now on to PDR, we have the performance data recorder, right? This shows your telemetry, your Gs, your zero to 60, your zero to 100, your track overlay, as well as track lap times. <laughs> This is an awesome option if you are going to track this car, but I'll tell you what, it's also an awesome option if you are not going to track the car. Now a full 32 gigabyte um, hard drive, or I'm sorry, um, SD card is about, about 755 minutes. But um, it's a really cool option because it one can serve as a dash cam, right? Whether you're a weekend driver or a serious driver, you can always use it as a dash cam. There's many other options out there as far as the better dash cam. But um, unless you're super serious and you drive all the time, maybe you can upgrade to a Garmin. But, you know, there's a lot of idiots out there on the road and, um, and it can help serve you as a defense mechanism in case somebody blames you or you're at fault. It can also be used to um, save you in case of a cop pulling you over and saying you were going a certain speed and you weren't. And number three, it's great to save your memories from the track, cruises, spirited drives, and other things. And what I love about the PDR is it not only records outside and in front of you, but it also can in, it also records the conversations you have inside in case you are with an instructor and he is telling you how to drive. But um, that's the number one thing about the PDR that I love the most. That's all I have for you guys today, but thank you guys so much for clicking play. If you guys found this video helpful, or if you're looking to um, find a Z06 with this option, I'm glad I could make this video for you guys. But if you could leave me a thumbs up, if you're new here, I would appreciate it if you could subscribe. But as always, I will see you guys on the next video, but it's time for me to get out of here.